Hello and welcome to another one of my TV videos, this time the 3D calibration for the LG E6. I'm doing this in the cinema user preset, so let's just check the 3D settings. Yeah, okay, it's on. Make sure your 3D color correction's turned on. Let's go back and look at the other settings. Brighten yourself up a little bit. Color up a little bit as well. This is all done with patterns. Expert controls, let's have a look what we need to change here. Nothing in the top here, this is all the same for 2D. Now we have a look at white balance. I've only done a two point correction here and I'll show you why later. You can see in the high point, quite a lot of correction in blue and red, nothing in green. As I've said before, my calibration settings here might not actually work that well on your set. It's always a good idea to do an individual calibration. Okay, so here, more correction, red, green, and blue. There's quite a big green push with the glasses applied. Okay, let's have a look at color management. I haven't had to do much here, mainly because if you do a lot in this section, it actually degrades the image. It introduces posterization effects. So just a little bit of luminance change on blue. So let's have a look and see what you actually need to do to your colorimeter. So what I've done here is I've taken out one of the lenses and a pair of 3D specs and placed it between the sensor and the screen. There's no point doing calibration without this in place as the sensor is actually emulating your eye. Let's have a look now at the results. Here's the grayscale. Everything is below 1.2. I could have got it even better, but there really is no point. It takes a lot of time and you don't see the difference. Okay, so here's the primary and secondary results. Not ideal, but getting them any better will actually make the picture look worse. As you can see, the CIE chart here is pretty good. Blue and green could do with improvement, but I've said it will actually degrade the picture. Thanks for watching and see you next time.